from our stoppage. I'm going to set up to set it up. Yeah, yeah. Um, it was, it, to be fair, it was all quite quick. Obviously, adrenaline rushing and all that. But I um, got in there nice and calm, relaxed. Um, this man here, Harry Andrews, my new coach alongside Ergen Omar over there. And um, they do a fantastic job with me. And today it was just about having a run out, um, putting into practice the things that they've been drilling into me in the gym. I listened and I really want to make them proud. I hope I did. Um, first round just went out there, found my range, saw what the opponent was about. And then um, second round just decided to turn it up. Um, I wasn't actually going for the um, stoppage. I was just turning it up for the sake of turning it up and the ref, yeah, and then the ref stepped in, so it is what it is. Either way, it looks good, I guess, and for the highlight reel and stuff. Yeah, yeah just about, um, yeah we're talking about uh, the stoppage, I think. Yeah, um, yeah, so, um, yeah, second round, um, I was finding my range and um, Harry in the corner just said to me, look, you know, you're looking brilliant, um, you're boxing well, just go out there, have a good time, and um, look for his body. And um, it was a barrage of punches, so I don't know what punch caused the referee to stop it, but I could see in there he didn't like the body shots. Um, every time there was some form of reaction, so, you know, we're done and, you know, that's great. Yeah. Um, obviously, um, it was ironic, on the same card as Zach, which yeah. obviously you fought... Um, October. Uh, yeah, October. Yeah. Um, both, both run and with knockouts. I mean, yeah. Is that a fight you, you want to avenge? Of course, point? of course. Um, listen, that fight's going to happen, without a doubt. It's, 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 really yeah. um, it's good though. I mean, it's, it's, I'll say yes and no because I think nowadays a lot of fighters talk about how confident they are, but they're not willing to take on challenges. You know. Thank you. Thank you. I'll, I'll give yeah. Frank for making that. Exactly. So I'm very confident in my ability. I still am, and obviously Zach is confident in his ability, so he took the fight too. And you know, it is what it is. Um, I'm still one of the hottest prospects in the country, and that fight's going to happen again at some point. And um, I believe Zach's going to want it again anyway, so yeah, it's going to happen at some point. So Stay tuned. Still, so we are both still signed to Frank. Easy, exactly, it's an easy fight to make, but for now, um, we've got to both go out our own ways and um, achieve great things so that when the fight does happen again, we're rewarded a lot better than we were for the first one. Yeah, yeah, some form of a title, a lot more exposure, the full works. So, um, you know, obviously I'd rather fight him now, but. I also understand that there are other things to factor in and I've got a team around me who advise me very well so um, it's a matter of ascending and growing as fast and, and good as I can and that fight is going to happen inevitably. Well, obviously you want to kind of get it built up, you know, yeah. make, make most amount of money and get for a title so hopefully you the know, we'll see that. Right? Yeah. Yeah, exactly, yeah. yeah, so obviously I wish Zach all the best and yeah. Um, yeah, we'll yeah, see yeah, yeah, he had good performance as well. Yeah. And, uh, I did, what, what, was it point stoppage? Uh, no, stoppage. It lasted about 30 seconds. Fuck you know, yeah. <laughs> so it'd be, uh, yeah, yeah. Fair to, but I mean, you both got stoppages. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, on the same show as also, it's yeah. building up nicely. Um, yeah, so we'll see when that happens. So ideally, what's going to be happening next when you hope to be out? Um, I hope to be out, well, I should be out on the next Frank Warren show um, in London. The next London one, sorry, because the next one's in Leeds, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. No, the next London show. And um, getting a stoppage in the second round, I'm sure, <laughs> makes that more likely to happen. So, um, actually, coming into this fight, because this opponent was last minute when I've had five changes of opponents in the past week, and um, I was watching, idea, yeah, I was watching, and he, like, he was taking cruiserweights the distance. Yeah, yeah, so I was just like, <laughs> you know, lie old Uma, I've had to eat to come up the weight to, to be able to fight him. Um, and I just thought, he's going to be hard to stop, so just go in there and go through the motions. And I guess it's that old adage, when you don't look for it, it comes. Um, in an ideal world, how many fights would you like this year and by the end of 2000? Um, I've actually got it mapped out. I should have five more fights. I would like to have five more fights this year. Um, three by the summer and then two after the summer. If I can have another three after the summer, that would be great. And at some point, it'd be a title at the end of the year. Is yeah, yeah. Kind of well, well, the sooner the better. <laughs> Before I go, do you want to shout out social media and sponsors or anyone, anything else you want to uh, Top Boxer Sadiq on all social media handles. I'm also a YouTuber, I vlog, so Umar Sadiq, Top Boxer and that. And um, my sponsors are BitStocks, best in cryptocurrency investment, best in, um, you know, changing the world for the better and revolutionising the way people <laughs> manage their finances. So, yeah, check them out, BitStocks. 
So he don't put me in the interview, my brother keeps filming. So he did not put me in the interview. Can you imagine? So at least my guys, my brother, we are very happy that he won. No, also, also again, it's part of my interview. You know, you know how to get there. This is like Nigerian. We eat jollof rice. We are happy for him. We are doing very well. Cheers. Thank you, sir. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> With that being said, see you later. Thank you.